Presuasion by Dr. Robert Cialdini. Welcome to my channel. My name is Samuel and I want to make self-growth normal. If you want to make self-growth normal, because I don't want to do it alone, and who doesn't want to make self-growth normal, then make sure to smash that like button for the YouTube algorithm. It helps with ranking and SEO and all this other stuff. And I really appreciate it because so much work goes into making these videos. This book is written by the author of Influence. Probably my favorite psychology book ever of all time ever forever and yes i know p-r-e-s-u-a-s-i-o-n is not how you spell persuasion but that's kind of the idea sort of this book is all about pre-persuasion how to effectively and efficiently increase the likeliness of a desired outcome by pre-suading what happens or i guess persuading what happens beforehand in other words what we present first changes the way people experience what we present next. The author explains, for example, how when he was younger he was able to read palms. It was before he learned about the secret senses of self-doubt that his recipients had. And that's really part of the reason why he could say, Oh, you are a person who is constantly second-guessing yourself. Most people are second-guessing themselves. So most people, if he says that to them, they're probably gonna be like, how did you know? Another example, instead of just asking someone for a few minutes of their time to survey them about altruism, the rate of reception will multiply. If you just go up to them and ask, do you consider yourself to be a helpful person? People almost invariably qual- 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 qualify themselves that's the word for this and lots of different things of this different varieties of what i just explained a very successful healthcare organization told the author before his talk at their headquarters that they don't like to use bullet points they don't want him to say he's going to use bullet points or any info about how he's going to attack the situation because they are an organization of healing so he was like um what they were like Instead of using bullet points, use information points. And instead of talking about how you're gonna attack the situation, talk about how you're gonna approach it. Because we are an organization of healing. And this is because the smallest differences in language result in the biggest results, or at least changes of them. And I had no idea how important this was. But a life insurance salesman who had sold more than probably any one of any other one ever and ended up in a hospital for, I don't know, something about his heart or his pancreas or something during a month that they eventually named after him in his honor, in the honor of his success. At the company, they all, when he was in the hospital at the company, the, the, the month was named after him so that, you know, in that month, I hope they're do they do this every month anyway, but in that month they were seeing who can sell the most. And he won <laughs> by selling life insurance in his hospital bed over the phone with all these different clients and stuff, which is pretty gangster. His only secret other than work ethic is in the book. And it does have to do with language, kind of like what we were just talking about. So I'm gonna just be brutally honest with you guys in some sort of conclusion and say that this book does bring up plenty of very valid points, but it simply is just like not close to as groundbreaking or captivating as influence, I'd say. And I'm sure that probably wasn't the author's intention. I mean, influence is, come on, man, it's influence. And I don't know how important it is, what I just said, because this book really does seem to serve as sort of a shadow to it. Like influence, again, Probably my favorite psych book of all time. Super freaky stuff. It's about the fix, the, the, the fix, the six things, principles that can be used to get anyone to say yes to you. And that might not sound creepy, but get the book and you'll know what I'm talking about. <laughs> it's really crazy stuff because it's true. And by creepy, I don't mean it has anything to do with ghosts or whatever, you know, come on guys, this is late November. We're a whole month late for that. And in terms of the sixth, this book actually has a seventh in it. But I think the idea of persuasion in general is kind of a seventh in its own. I mean, if it's persuasion, I guess it would be the first of the and then the six, the other six would follow because it's before them. But the whole, the whole section about associations being the building blocks of thought, I felt that. It's one of my, one of my favorite like chunks of any book ever. It's the type of chapter that I think explains so much about why we feel the way we do about things. Also, the chapter about After Effects with 
post suasion. Quotes. If the phone doesn't ring, it's me. When attention is paid to something, the price is attention paid to something else. When an important outcome is unknown to people, they can hardly focus on anything else. I think, therefore I link. Anything too stupid to be spoken can be sung. Those who cheat for you will cheat against you. Direction one. I recommend this book for anyone who's curious, like what is affecting my results that I cannot control. Because this book will tell you that there is plenty more that you have the ability to control than you think. Direction two. If you like this book, I recommend, but Influence. If you haven't checked out Influence, The Psychology of Persuasion by Dr. Robert Cialdini, dude, check that one out. That is a phenomenal sword if you're going to use this one as a shield. In terms of modern sight, it's probably right up there with thinking fast and slow. I think it's a little overhyped. So Influence and Definitely subliminal by Letter Mo Leonard Mladenov. It goes just a little deeper into what kind of drives a lot of the decision making and communication discussed in Presuasion. Presuasion by Dr. Robert Cialdini, an amazing psychologist. There's a link in the description if you guys want to check it out and read the reviews. That and all the other books that I mentioned in this video, if you want to check those out as well. Sugar! If there are any other books that you guys want me to check out and review, please let me know in the comments below. Also, let me know if you checked out this book and you liked it, but hey. Make sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, because I don't know why people watch this far into my videos and they don't subscribe, but if you have subscribed and you want to turn up just a notch and turn on that notification bell to receive a notification every time I drop a new video, that would mean the world to me. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. You can find me everywhere, and I will see you then.